Whispering winds weave the water as we wait for the warlike wahoo to whack the wriggling, wandering wobbler. Wise words wasted as we wait. Wham! Without warning, war begins. Winding, winding with willpower, we wrestle, whooshing through the water, writhing, wriggling, waltzing, wrecking. Wearily winching, wilting and woozy we wage. With wisdom, he wins. Alliteration is the repetition of the same letter or sound at the beginning of words. It's used to create rhythm, mood and tone within a poem. This poem is whooshing with alliteration. Almost every word begins with a wuh, and the repetition of wuh sounds create a rolling rhythm that conveys the wild, watery world of the wise wahoo fish. So why do we use alliteration? Alliteration is enjoyable to read and hear. It helps to create and communicate the mood of a poem. What kind of mood could the repetition of a s sound create? It could suggest the slippery and slithery movements of a snake. Now it's your turn to create alliteration. Choose an object or an animal. What sound does it start with? Make a list of words that start with the same sound. Which words could be used to describe your object?